Hi, this is Shane and welcome to a brand new mod pack and it's called Peace of Mind. Now this is the kind of mod pack I wish I had when I started playing modded, which is about two years now I've been playing it and basically it is designed to be played on peaceful, you start off in peaceful and it's showing you how to play how how to learn different um different mods so let's make a world so we'll just call this Sh oh no why did you not want to work that's a bit strange i can't even spell my own name shane plays and game mode obviously survival more wo more world options the seed we're going to put that as shane plays all right shane plays this time i'm going to play with cheats off usually i play with them on but let's play it how it's supposed to be played you can preview um your world but i always find that takes really a long time so i don't bother with that and we're done okay create new world okay that had me speechless for a minute. Wow. That looks really pretty. That really, really is. Is that a village? There is a village. There's a village right there. In that direction. Now there is no... I don't know... How do you turn on antique maps? Does that not... Uh, the sun's rising. There's no way to mark this as spawn. Let's just go straight to that village. Before we even start, let's just go to the village. There's an astral sorcery temple in front of... Oh, you know what? We need to pick up. We need to pick up food. Because when I started playing in my test world, I was like, yeah, this is brilliant. Let me just find some play... Oh, hibiscus. I do love hibiscus. It makes good drink. If you've never had a hibiscus drink, it makes like... It's like, um, like squash, like juice. If you've never had that, that is awesome. Sorry, yeah, got a bit sidetracked. So, um, yeah, when I was playing my test world, see the fishes, there's fishes. They're in the water. That's so cool. And um, I was like, yeah, this is brilliant. Let me just get on with what I'm doing. And went on my merry way rejoicing, not taking very much notice of anything. And oh, that's not what I wanted to do. And I died of hunger. I was like, really? Yeah. So this, oh, beetles. I guess they're not going to do anything to you because we're on peaceful. But there's beetles. There is, that's a fawn, a deer from Roots 2. But we're in a village. There's waystones in this village. Let's go and we're in, uh, I won't even bother to, to pronounce that. Can you rename waystones? I don't know if you can rename them, but we're in something. And in my um, my Autonotom series, I'm living in a house like this. We are not going to do that today. I think we will build our own place. Hello, Bailey. Oh, you can do stuff and get um i think you get rewards for those catch 12 salmon just chill okay you can do things and get rewards wow okay that's something worth noting but we're here in this village which is cool i don't think i will live in the village i will probably live just outside of the village Let's see, what is the... I can't help it. I'm on automatic mode here. Okay. We have stuff. We won't need the armour. But we'll take it anyway. Um, If I do live in the village, I usually take 
that big house. I think we'll... Oh, I don't know. Because if we live in the village, then, you know, we don't have to worry about building a house. Oh, you've got, um, uh, what do you call it? I can see my breath. There's some kind of seasons thing in here. Okay. Let us live just outside of the village, I think. On the side of this pond looks rather good. I think we'll set up shop here. And then if we need anything, we can go into the village. But we're not going to bother the natives. So, now that we've established where we are going, let's have a look at our quest book. Um, what key is it? Is it bound to? I don't know. Let's have a quick look. Um, oh, I need to change a few things. Escape. Options. Uh, video settings. I need to change the brightness all the way up. So when I go down into caves and stuff, you can see. So that's that. Uh, controls, auto jump is off. Thank goodness for that. And we need to go in and change the conflicted keys, the ones that are highlighted in red. So if I click on show conflicts, sniff, sniff, sneak, we need. This we don't. So click on it and hit escape. Click escape baubles inventory auto jump to show the recipe. Okay, so we're done. But it still didn't tell us what key uh, that's what that's why I went in, in the first place. What key is the quest book bound to? Um is it better questing? Open quests minus. Okay. So if we hit the minus key, there you go, quest book. Important pack info. Okay. Um, welcome to Peace of Mind. Here are some things that you should know. You've got JEI is the mod that adds the search bar and the pages of items. Um, right, so if you, you can type at mod name in the search bar and only items for that mod will search will show up. For example, typing at Britannia will make it so that only Britannia items are displayed. We knew that. Ore excavation. Did you know this pack has ore excavation? By pressing the tilde key, which is the key next to the number one, usually, on a keyboard, um, you can break a whole bunch of twos at the same time. It's great for mining a whole mine, a whole vein of ore at once or clearing lots of stone. Be careful though, you can't control how much is removed. And you can, you might just remove the blocks right below your feet if you're not careful. Also, if you switch the key binding, you can mine more than one block. I think V is the default for that one for mining for for um for the key bindings. Seasons. There's a mod called Serene Seasons that adds seasons to Minecraft, so expect rivers to freeze over and the leaves to change colour. These are just for looks. It's fun to see your base in different seasons. Okay. So we can click that and submit. And then not so not so important info. U FTB utilities, chunk animator, chunk pre-generator, dynamic surroundings. Okay. Uh, little things like footsteps, new sounds, and cool particle effects. The config of this mod is quite extensive, so if you don't like some features, go ahead and disable them to your liking. Hunger in peace, so that you have to eat in peaceful, and disables peaceful health regeneration. Key slabs. This mod makes it players so makes it so players can press shift to break only the top or bottom slab instead of both. And mouse tweaks. You can use this so that you can use the scroll wheel to quickly move items between inventories. Okay, that's fine. What's this? Quest book update. You need dirt and seeds. And why do we knew that? Craft this to update your quest book when updates are rolled out. Okay. If you lose your book, all you need is one Minecraft seed and one Minecraft dirt to put in a, into a crafting table. Okay, well we didn't have a book. 
but that's fine. It's nice to know that that's there. And what are these pack information updates? Okay, well, seeing that we're playing the latest pack, I don't think we need to read these, but, you know, you can read at your leisure. Yeah, we haven't... I know. I didn't claim my experience. Um, yeah, we haven't... I mean, we're playing the latest version. So that doesn't matter. Okay, let's go into the basics. You've got the basics. Peaceful recipes, because obviously if you're on peaceful, there's no mobs to kill. So this is how you get these. How do you get the Wither Star? Soul Sand and three skulls to craft your Nether Star. Okay. That sounds pretty interesting. Farming and cooking, which is tea, corn, and so much more. What's this down here? I don't know what that means. Oh. Tinkering away for Tinker's Construct. We can do a bit of that today. Decoration station. Oh, that's just decorating stuff. The little things. Random thing, random small things from various mods. Um, inventory pets, roots, astral sorcery, Britannia, hopper ducks, ceramics, uh, magical sci, immersive engineering, rustic, and extra utilities. This should be fun because I mean this is not going to. It's not going to do any um any recipe tweaks and stuff, so it should be okay. Doggy talents. Oh. Roots, rustic, immersive engineering, astral sorcery, Britannia, extra utilities to, and advanced storage time. Okay, so it's refined storage, basically. So if I do that, scroll out, does that put that... Oh, that brings it back into the screen. And what this is for, I don't know. Alright, so let's go back to the basics. Day one. We want 32 wood. Alright, let's just find a, um, a tree. Let's just find some trees and let's get some wood. Because it says it's any wood, so we should be okay with that. Um... Let's go up here. And of course it doesn't matter that it's getting to be night time. We've got some sheep up there. That's good. Because there's no mobs. Did it just update the quest that I'm doing? Um, 16. No, we need more. We need... We need a bit more. Oh, my breath's showing. That's pretty cool. I like that. I really do like that. Yeah, sheep. No, I'm coming back for you later. There is some pineapples, which are really good for restoring hunger. What were those things? Let's have a look. Ginseng root. Okay. And let's see. Where can we get some more? Oh, pressed the wrong key. Where can we get some more? stuff okay where else can we get wood come on it can't be this hard to get wood oh tumbleweeds can i catch how, how do you catch those i want to catch one do you just stand in the way and let it roll over you No. Oh, we punch it. Oh, we got a diamond. We got a diamond from a tumbleweed. That is awesome. We got a diamond from a tumbleweed. I wish tumbleweeds were like that in real life. Uh, right, let us mine that as well. Okay, we've got wood, finally. Get some more pineapple. 
like I said, they're really good for hunger. Okay, so let's claim 32 more blocks of wood. Then we need to get a stack of cobblestone. I guess this wouldn't be, you know, a Minecraft mod pack if we didn't have to do something like get stone. All right, I think what we will do, we'll build a temporary base in the village. So in this house here, we will put all our stuff. We don't have to worry about zombies and stuff, so we can just break a hole in the fence and go this way. Hi, buddy. Um, what are you? You're a Fletcher. Now you want arrows. Right, let's make a tool thing. A tool thing. Yeah, that's the technical term for it, a tool thing. And because we've got tinkers in it, we can turn it into a tinker's table. Let's put you behind here. And I think instead of making lots of um, vanilla tools, we'll just go straight into Tinkers. What quest do they have for Tinkers? Can I go into that? Tinker in a way. All right, I need to make all of this ta all the tables. Okay, we can do that. I need, oh, before I start, let me just open my loot chests. Oh, nice. Ender Pearl, Blaze Rod, and Gas Tear. And, oh, great. More Ender Pearls, another Blaze Rod, and a Gas Tear. That is absolutely awesome. Oh, oh, God. What were you doing, buddy? Right, let us make a couple of chests to put our stuff into. Now, does it have the thing where you can take... Yes, you can take the wood logs and craft them into chests, which is brilliant. I oh, know that's not going to open because it's under a block. Right, put that there. This bottom one, we'll put all our bird's nests, which we can open in a bit. In this one, we'll put food. Actually, I think in the bottom one, we'll just put all our, all the bits that we get. Um, the gas tears. And this one will go food and seeds. Anything plant E. And then top, oh God, same problem. You can tell I'm really not with it today. Oh, let's just hide the window. Who needs a window? Okay. Plant some blocks for now. Buddy, get off of my table. Alright, let's take you, take you back, take you back. Right, take this stuff out. We need to make some sticks. And we need to turn you into planks. How many sticks we got? We need four on each side. Take the sticks, put them like that to make blank patterns. Then to make, let me see, you need a log and a pattern to give you a part builder. You need a crafting table and a pattern to give you a tool station. You need, oh dear, my brain is failing me. Did I do the pattern and the log? I think I just did, didn't I? A stencil table, no. Need a pattern and a plank to give you a stencil table. So those are your four tables. Part builder, tool station, stencil table, crafting table, four. Then we need um, a chest and a pattern to make a pattern chest. And I'm missing one. 
you need need more sticks plus another chest so let's make a chest and planks I think to make a pan chest a part chest oh I know what else I had to do I had to center this because I don't like it off to the side um, options con no not controls so controls no 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 go into JEI JEI config center search bar true done there you go and now it's in the center I prefer it that way I don't know why <laughs> it just bugs me if it's not okay what we want we were looking for a pattern chest pattern chest pattern chest no it wasn't a pattern chest it was a parts chest would help if I could spell it I think that's everything you just push me buddy really what is your problem I had everything that's it and a parts chest and I think that's the tinkers the tinkers uh, part builder stencil table we've made those oh you know why I think it's because it's not um, vanilla wood it's not the oak wood all right let's so that is the part builder and the stencil table is that yes there you go it's because it wasn't the vanilla wood which is a real pain okay let's put actually I need to break those let's just put these down anyway because I need all of them I'll change them around later Part builder. Is that the part chest I put in the middle? No, that's not the bit I need. It's the pattern chest I need to put down. Part builder. What was that part builder? Stencil table. And the tool station. Right, so they're all connected. Put patterns in the pattern chest. No, not in the pattern chest. Put the patterns in the stencil table it's been a it's been a little bit since i've played with tinkers because a lot of the mod packs i've been playing lately don't have tinkers in it right so we need I'm sure there's another quest let's claim more oak wood get a better tool so we need a pickaxe head pattern pickaxe binding tool rod pattern i don't know why it's saying it's complete because i don't have those but there you go stone pickaxe head paper binding and a wooden tool all right so if we're going to make these anyway um stencil table we need the pickaxe heads we need the binding and we need the tool rod and they all go in the pattern chest so if we make everything out of wood first, part builder, let's break down, oh I didn't need to come out of there, let's break down some more, actually no, we have wood. So part builder, put a stack of wood here, a wooden pickaxe head, a wooden tool rod, and wooden binding. Not the best durability, but wood has the ecological trait, which means quest. Really? How is that quest complete? It wanted paper. That's interesting. I made everything out of wood, but it still saw it. Okay, I'm not complaining. Let's clean that loot crate, loot chest. And then we need to make grout to make a smeltery. We don't want that right now. I just wanted to make 
um, a tool. So let us click on the pickaxe, put everything in, tool rod. Let's name our pickaxe, <clears throat> um, Axel, Axel F. There you go. So he's done. Or sh yeah, he, he, she, doesn't really matter. Pickaxe is done. We will need to bring the tool station with us. Did we make a tool? No, we made a stencil table, not a tool station. It's... Right, now we need to go make a... Now go get a stack of fish. I've noticed that. The fish will jump out onto the, onto the dock. That's pretty. Cambridge blue. Yeah, the fish will jump out onto the dock because I don't know why it does that. That's a bit random, but okay. Now there was, there was a cave somewhere close by. Where did I see a cave? There you go, uh, no. Where's the cave? There was a cave under the village. Onto the ice, really shame. Oh, there's the cave. <laughs> All right, let's take you down. Oh, that's from that there. All right, let's get some. Okay, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> I did not mean to Okay, so we, we got our stack, which is fine. I didn't mean to press um, or excavator, but that worked. That totally worked. And then that means we can update our pick. Okay, part builder. Uh, we want the head, put that there, and now we've got a stone head. If we go to the tool station, I think I can't just replace it, I need to mend it first. Actually, let's see. Let's see if I can replace it. Let's test that theory out. But it will, it will replace it as broken. We don't want to repair it before that. So let's repair it first because it only takes three bits of wood. So the durability will go up from 75 to 128. So now we've repaired it. We've got a better axe. And we got the basics. We got stone as well claim and we got 64 more cobblestone just in case we needed it and we need a bed can you make shears as in like wooden shears because we have sheep around I don't want to kill the sheep yet shears wooden shears we can make those oh there's a recipe conflict so you click on this button right there you go that button and let's go share some sheep. Did I just hear an enderman? I swear I just heard an enderman warping around. All right, sheep, where are you? You were out here. You were out here. I bet you now that I'm looking for you, you will disappear. I know oh, there's two up there on the hill. Um, don't run. I'm not going to kill you. He ran. I just want your wool. That's two. And we need another sheep. Just one more sheep. One more sheep. Where are you as a cow? Oh, I wonder what... Oh, it's some kind of dungeon. 
And of course, because we're on peaceful, we can totally go down there. Oh, we got two from you. You're very healthy. Let's get two from you. Because I don't want to have to keep coming back and getting sheep. Why couldn't I find sheep like you in my test game, in my practice game? Am I full? Or is it because the two of you were fused? There you go. I think it's because the two of you were fused. Right, that's plenty of wool. Yeah, my practice world, I was running around for days. I got loads of um, string and I had to turn the string into wool in order to make my bed because I couldn't find any sheep. Okay, let's run. Can we run? No, we can't run. You don't want to run. Okay, that's fine. It's not that we have, you know, it's not that we've got time to waste or anything. But, um, but yeah. So we've got our wool. We can make a bed. And we can tick that quest off before we end the episode. Okay, up we go. In we go. And let's make a bed. There's your three planks, there's your three wool, and we have a white bed. There we go. And we can claim that too. Let's open our loot chest. Wow, more ender pearls. That is, that is pretty amazing. I am not complaining at all. So we have almost a stack of ender pearls. A stack and a half of blaze rods and did we get some gas tears as well and 24 gas tears which is brilliant that's it for this episode please like comment and subscribe for more great content it will help to grow my channel okay thanks for watching bye bye